Hey guys, welcome back to welcome another back. video. So we are at a doctor's appointment right now. We are a little early, so we're just out here waiting, um, enjoying the weather. It's really nice outside. But basically today we are getting the baby's gender. They're gonna give us the envelope with the baby's gender. I'm super excited because our gender reveal is very, very soon. We were actually able to get this a long time ago, but I decided not to because, um, you know, we are in Southern California and I would have to mail it to my person who is doing the gender reveal in Sacramento. Yeah. So I was like, let me not have it in my hands because I would be tempted. Mm -hmm. I know Ruben would definitely open that I would envelope. open it. I would open it for sure. So I was like, let me just ask for it the closer we get to the gender reveal so yeah. I can just mail it to her. So we are going to do that. I'm so excited. But I'll update you guys once we get inside. Okay guys, so we just got our room. Um, I'm so excited to see the baby. I was showing Ruben the girls versus boys because we're going to get our gender today. But look, they do the girls versus boys. So this is our ultrasound? No. See how it's a boy? That's not ours. I'm just joking. <laughs> boys versus girls. So basically, they know it's a boy. This. That's the little ding a ling. <laughs> the little ding a ling. And then this is the girls. This is the belly update. I need to get new clothes because my belly pops out from the bottom. Let me see. Uh, the baby moves so much, you guys. <gasps> and I actually have anterior placenta, which means that my placenta, my, my placenta, mm -hmm. which means my placenta is in front of the baby. Um, so it's not something like super abnormal, like it's something that um, a lot of women have. The only difference is that sometimes you don't feel your baby kick as much because the placenta acts like a pillow in front of like your baby and your, your tummy. But I felt my baby kick since like 17 weeks and uh, Ruben has felt the baby kick maybe like three, four times. It is active, you guys. Sometimes mm -hmm. in the morning, it wakes me up from just the kicking. Like I don't need no alarm clock. So. Yeah, I feel like I'm really happy about that because I thought when they told me that I had interior placenta, I thought I wasn't going to feel the kicks until like later on. Um, but I've been feeling the kicks pretty early, so I'm really excited for that. Yeah, and whenever they do an ultrasound, the baby likes to move a lot. They always tell us that yeah. every ultrasound that the baby is super active. So yeah. our baby is going to keep us busy. Yeah. <laughs> We're going to have to like put it in sports and take it out into the outdoors all the time so that way it can wear off mm -hmm. its energy. Karen Karen says that um, the baby always wakes her up, wakes her up in the middle of the night. Yeah, the cakes are so strong that the baby mm -hmm. wakes me up. It's crazy. And just, I think it was either yesterday or the day before, normally I just feel like kicks on this side. So I know that the baby's, the baby's like legs and feet are on this side and the baby's head is on this side. Um, so normally I just feel like the kicks down here, mm -hmm. but yesterday you guys, I felt punches on this side and kicks on this side. <laughs> so I don't know what my baby was doing there, but it's super active. Okay, so we got moved to another room because that was the ultrasound room. So this is like a regular check-in room. Um, but yeah, like I was saying, we need to get rid of that envelope as soon as we get it because Ruben has literally been telling me as soon as he gets it that he's going to open it. And I don't trust him, so I need to get rid of it. But you guys, the gender reveal is coming up really soon, so make sure you guys stay tuned and comment down below if you guys are team boy or team girl. You guys, we finally have the gender in our hands. This is the baby's gender. Should we open it? No, I knew you were going to say that. <laughs> he wants to open it so bad, but we're actually going to go to the post office right now and send it to the girl who's doing the gender reveal. So that way she can start planning it out. Karen doesn't even let me hold it. It's because I feel like you guys, I feel like Ruben's going to purposely have an accident somehow take the tape off and find the gender but well, why don't you let me hold it like why can't it be in my possession for like a minute because this whole time we've been here <laughs> you literally said let me open it just to take a quick peek and nobody has to know he's a cheater you guys i think he's gonna be a girl the baby is kicking i think he's gonna be a girl i think it's going to be a boy i'm excited now for the gender reveal yeah we actually have a gender reveal coming up you guys so now that we have the envelope we are official so gender reveal coming up soon i'm so excited but i feel like everybody like 90 percent of people think it's a girl yeah 
Seriously. Even, even with your uh, poll that you did, mm -hmm. girl or boy, everyone said it's going to be a everyone girl. Everyone thinks it's going to be a girl. So we finally have it right here. Now we just have to wait for the gender reveal to find out. All right, guys, so we just got to Laguna Beach. This is where we're going to be doing our gender reveal photo shoot. Karen, look. I put this outfit together maybe like three days ago, so it's super last minute, but I really like it. You like it? Karen's looking bomb like always. We got our baby. What do you think it's gonna be? I don't know. Gender reveal video coming, coming soon. soon. Let's show them your outfit. And then this is Ruben's outfit. How do I look? Handsome like always. This is going to be the first spot we're going to take the, sh the photos at. Yeah. And then you guys, this is Adrian. He is going to be doing our, um, what's it called? Our pregnancy announcement. He's so, so good. I'm going to put my our, uh, his Instagram down below so you guys can check him out. And then we also brought some props. So we got like these flowers. I got these from Trader Joe's. And then I also went to Hobby Lobby. And got some cute little props for the video. So we got the bear. We got the baby's outfit. Some wooden hangers. So we'll see what we can do with this. And we we came here we came here yesterday to kind of scope out like yeah. where, we, where we wanted to take pictures at. So this is the the first spot that we found, and we found a couple other. Yeah, Lots but Adrian is so good with telling us what to do yeah. and how to do it and then when the video comes together It looks so it looks like a movie yeah, looks, like a novela. Yeah, that's what, that's what we're going for. Yeah, you guys are a good model So you guys are, uh, make my job Yeah, so it's so exciting. I'm ready to see it, but look at the view and we're gonna get started right now Okay, hold on. Put this camera down. And I'm cold now. Look how dirty she got. Karen got in the water, taking some fire ass pictures. Yeah. I'm gonna show you guys these pictures. Um, well, you guys will see them on the Yeah. So, how do you guys feel that you guys are gonna be aunts and uncles? This is what you guys have been waiting for. This is what everybody's been wanting. Yeah, Karen. seriously, guys. You guys are always in my DMs asking for a baby. So, here it is. The baby, oh my baby. Are you guys team girl or team boy? What do you guys think it is? We have our gender reveal coming up in a couple yeah. weeks. So we're excited for that. So comment down below if you think it's a boy or comment down below if you think it's a girl. What do you think it is? I think it's gonna be a girl. I think it's a boy. Perfect, 50-50. Yeah. <laughs> when we went to the ultrasound, we were like, can you double check if there's another one in there? She's like, nope, there's only one. And I was like, okay. Imagine twins though. Oh That's what your mom had to go through. Mm -hmm. Two babies. Oh my god. How would you feel about that? I wouldn't be able to keep up with twins. I would be excited. I feel like uh, it's fun to have twins. Yeah, but you would want twins? Yeah. Is there a possibility? Maybe on our next one. Maybe. When are we going to have the next one? I haven't even had this one yet. I want to have the next one like right away. Like within like the next after we give birth maybe like a couple months after yeah the baby does need a sibling that way we can have like just get it all over with already i don't know guys this pregnancy has been tough i'm so grateful because it's such a blessing to carry but it's been tough yeah karen has been sick she's been feeling nauseous yeah she's been feeling sick since like this whole pregnancy she hasn't 
like in the beginning she wasn't really craving a lot of stuff but now i feel like she's starting to crave stuff i feel like uh, now it's going away a little bit so now i'm eating more i'm craving mm, but not really crave i feel like it's just fruit like i just want fruit yeah she's been eating really healthy healthier than before like she was before like she would eat in and out she doesn't like it just throw me in the fucking mud <laughs> no she, guys seriously all i crave is like fresh like food, like fruit, I crave water. I couldn't eat in and out I actually ate in and out for the first time yesterday. But yeah, yeah. I couldn't even eat in and out. It's really healthy. Yeah, so I I'm was kind of worried though because I'm like, dude, I'm not eating. Like, you know, I need to feed yeah. my baby. But luckily, my appetite is picking up, and um, and now I'm getting my energy back too. So that's good. But yeah, Karen before wouldn't even she wouldn't even like keep up with like doing all this stuff that we're yeah. doing she would just want to be in bed all day so <laughs> you are just gonna am i not supposed to say boy. this or what this is the truth like, yeah she's lazy she would eat in and out <laughs> I, is this not i thought <laughs> <laughs> you're a no yeah that's the truth that's yeah the truth. that's the truth i literally could not get out of bed i was throwing up three to four times a day yeah. I was not eating. But I'm pretty sure a lot of girls can relate to this. Yeah. You know, you being sick, so pregnancy sickness. But she's feeling good now. She's looking good. But I'm you know what? Ruben has been such an angel. Like, seriously, the best of the mm. best. I There's no way that I, I could have done this without him. Well, duh. But yeah. <laughs> there's no way that I could have survived this. I know it sounds a little like dramatic but seriously guys it, it was bad and Ruben like it, it sucks a little bit because like I don't have my mom and I feel like I don't have my mom here and I feel like it's nice to have your mom when you're going through this like a pregnancy you know but my mom's just like a phone call away and she's always there for me she's always checking up on me but like physically having Ruben here and him being an amazing partner like means so much whenever I'm craving something he goes out and gets it like he's there for me he loves on me he hugs me he makes sure the baby's okay he makes sure i'm okay um if i'm feeling tired like he's like no babe like i got it i'll wash the dishes i'll do the laundry i'll cook seriously i'm not exaggerating he does all that and i will forever be grateful because i feel like this you know people remember what they go through yeah. in their pregnancy and i feel like this is just something that i'm going to remember forever yeah, and I mean, it's the least I can do, you know, try to I'm help out. Me pregnant. I try to help out as much as I can. She's already going through a lot, so I want to be very supportive. So now that we are finished, we are going to go home, probably get something to eat, get some rest, look at the footage that we got, and hopefully we get to share it with you guys as soon as possible. I'm so excited to share it with you guys. I know we're going to get a lot of positive uh, feedback. Feedback. <laughs> I know we're gonna get a lot of like love from you guys, so yeah. I'm I'm excited. Yeah, so we will see you guys on Instagram. If you guys see this video, is because we already announced it on our Instagram. So make sure to go check out our video on IG. Bye.